Yeah, I saw the fight with Lucas Brown, but I thought I thought uh, uh, Tal was was a bit shaky from the start, the way he was fighting. He never seemed to relax in the fight. Let me turn this. He never seemed to relax in the fight. And uh, when he got hit, he didn't respond well, you know? If you're jittery and nervous in a fight and you get clipped, it, it, it will daze you and ultimately it, it will stop you. That's what made Muhammad Ali able to take a punch so well because he was always relaxed when he got hit. Even though he might have got shook up, he was always able to come back because he was so relaxed. And Richard didn't seem like he was very relaxed in that fight. He was boxing real jittery, you know what I'm saying? But I saw some some things in the fight that let me know that Richard could have won that fight. Richard could have won that fight. I felt that he could have did some things. He didn't work his jab enough. You know, he didn't give enough real, really, really confident move. He was moving out of necessity instead of moving out of confidence, you know? So I, I thought that he got tagged, he got hit on the ropes, and never quite recovered from it. Do because he, he... Go ahead. He was jittery, you know? When you're jittery like that, he can't take a shot. Do you think that had anything to do with the fact that he'd been sparring with David Hay before he fought? No, 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 no. No, because I saw the same thing when he's boxing a lot of the You got to understand, Richard Tower doesn't have that much experience. Right. He's learning on the job. So I saw the same kind of jittery, you know, the jittery style when he's boxing a lot. He's just got to find his, himself in boxing and go from there, you know. But he needs to stay busy. He needs to keep going, you know. Okay. But he's got to learn defense, too. He's got to learn defense because he's a tall, lanky guy. He's a tall, lanky guy. He's got to learn defense. He's got to learn to use a good jab. I didn't see that good jab. But he's got to use a good, confident jab. Not a scared jab. A confident jab. A jab that says, I'm going to take this fight over, not you. I thought I, I didn't think that Lucas Brown had that much on... on, on uh, this young man, I don't think that Lucas Brown had that much on him. I think Richard was just jittery and nervous and got clipped, and as a result, he was taken out. Okay. Um, so what do you think of uh, Lucas Brown as a fighter? Big, strong guy, but very ordinary. Very predictable, you know? They're trying to push Fury, and a lot of the people on Twitter are trying to push Fury into fight with Brown. Fury should beat him. Fury brings more to the table than him. Fury is a better boxer than him. Fury should beat him. Fury should box circles around him.